Hello guys and welcome to another tutorial video. This tutorial is going to be an updated version of the tutorial I did before uh, on my channel. Uh, how to install script hook 5. Uh, firstly, uh, what you want to do, create a mods folder on your desktop, anywhere, doesn't matter. Um, and then open up your web browser. Then head to a site which I'll link in the description called gta5mods.com When you're here, you just want to either type up in the search bar script hook 5 or look for it manually under scripts but typing it is a lot more efficient There we go So this is the one I use and a load of other people use You can use some of these but this one is specifically for the script hook 5 animated trainer so what you want to do is click on that uh, there is a tutorial kind of down here but if you want to know how to do it then that's why you're here uh, you want to click download it'll take you to this site don't panic uh, all you want to do from here is click download not for developers uh, just click download and it will download in a file down here um, from here you can either click and drag it onto your desktop or just drag it straight into your mods folder which I'm going to do. From here, you just close that down. You don't need any of this now. All you'll need is to go into the file and then go into bin and it's these three files. dimput8.dll, nativetrainer.asi and scripthook5.dll. Next, you want to navigate to your Grand Theft Auto on Steam. Uh, mine is here. All you want to do is right click that, go to properties, uh, go to local files, browse local files. Um, if you've not got this game on Steam, um, you can go to wherever, wherever you installed it. Here's some questions from the last video. Uh, you can go to wherever you installed it and then find the files. Um, but this is all you have to see in here. Um, after you've done that, just put, I don't know, slap that to the side of the screen. And um, then open your... Oh, that's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. Okay, open your mods folder. Go into that. Go into bin. And then all you have to do from here is copy these three files. And paste them into your uh, GTA 5 folder. From here, you can just go into Steam and actually run the game. So, as soon as I have loaded up the game, I will uh, continue recording. Alright, now that we're in GTA, uh, you should just be able to click F4 and it shall open. A few questions I got on the last video uh, is if you toggle numlock, it won't work. For example, I'm tapping numlock now and it won't turn off. As you can hear. But if I tap non lock again, it'll turn off and on. So what you need to do from here is, um, well, you've in you've done it, pretty much. Um, to do stuff, to navigate around, you use 2, 4, 8 and 6. Uh, for example, I'm going to click 5 to select now. Um, and, I don't know, add cash and it'll give me money. Uh, weapons, get all weapons car spawner using six to go to the right and two, um, four to go to the left, sorry. Uh, and then five to spawn in the vehicle. So yeah, guys, that's about it on how to install Script Hook 5. Uh, that's the updated tutorial version. I'll be recording a, uh, another video on a, a tutorial straight after this, so you guys can know how to install another mod that I use sometimes in videos. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video.